Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. And so, the national anthems. Norway have opted for a 4-5-1 formation, it appears, Jim. Well, the lone striker has to be prepared to do some of the work himself, but essentially he needs two of the three central midfielders to make runs beyond him and trust that the wide men can, can service the penalty box and make those link-up runs from out to in. He should get plenty of support with this setup. So it's away we go then. Johansson plays it forward. Hoists it forward. Ah, oh, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. Looking to hit one! He's pulled off a fine save! James Forrest is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Shoots! Looks to bypass the midfield. A heavy challenge. Little doubt, that is a foul. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Looks to clip it forward. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Has a hit! Shooting chance! Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Well, here is the raid we were told to expect. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, that is very close. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Omar El Abdullawi. Uh, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Plays it out to the flank. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? He gets past his man. Shoots! Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. Good effort. Very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though.
Omar El Abdullawi. That's not going to make it. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. And it's played forward, he's found his man. Driving on, a real charge here. Hit into the middle. Goalkeeper's ball. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. And the half-time whistle goes. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. The midway point of the game. What a pleasant surprise to see how open this game is, is turning into. Just wondering if the two teams are, are going to keep doing what we've seen in the first half. I hope that a cautious aspect doesn't kick in. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. And we're off again. So deadlock still as the second half begins. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. between him and the keeper, and he won it with a cracking piece of trickery. A 1-0 lead established. Oh, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. He's put it on the right now. What's on? It is quite a run he's making here. Looks to drop one in. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Now a chance to break. Fraser crosses. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take, though, Peter. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Forward it goes. to get it forward quickly. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Well, that's where he wants it. Going through. This could fall anywhere. Taken out, that'll be a foul. And he is going into that little black book. Sit high. It's 
Scotland are making a change now. run through the middle but he needs support room for a shot hits one a real chance and a real let off james forrest really drove at the heart of that defense incisive quick but not clinical there's a player in need of attention here yeah, and the manager's concerned too. Substitution time, perhaps, or maybe not. We'll see. Looks as though he's going to see if he can shake it off. The changes then in quick succession. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Hoists it forward, and they've been caught out here. Tries a header! No, he didn't quite meet it right. And he's managed to get himself offside. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Well, it looks to me as though this could well be the end of the road for him as far as today's game is concerned. Yeah, and I think he's, he's been facing a losing battle here. Well, I don't think there was anything else he could have done. But there's going to be another change here. He's been taken off, and I'm guessing this is... And the keeper's given it away. Face to face with the keeper. Big chance! It's in! They have stolen level at the last! A moment that needed composure, and he had plenty of it. I just thought he knew exactly what he was doing by feigning to move one way and then readjusting back. Controlled trickery. All square again into the dying minutes. 90 minutes up, we're into stoppage time. Chance! Great build-up, it all deserved a better ending. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. Ninety minutes up, and we will be back for extra time. Yeah, this has been a hard-fought game, Peter. There's been a healthy dose of drive and ambition, and sometimes that isn't rewarded with goals just like this one. I've seen a lot worse, though. Well, fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. Stern test this for the endurance, for the character of the players as we head into extra time. Norway pay the price for failing to close out the match in normal time. Can they avoid the same fate here where the consequences are still more serious? He's gone for it! And for a moment, time stood still. 
You lucky boy. You lucky, lucky boy. Giving the ball away like that is usually punished. quick to react to the initial save and he has his reward that's just top notch showed exactly why he follows it up every time keeper struggles to hold on to it ball breaks kindly he's always about Norway get themselves into the lead. It's a loose ball. Has a hit! And that could come back to haunt them. Oh, that's a great response, though, and it's a statement declaring that they're not done with this yet. And it's played forward. It's the, he's gone for it! So close to drawing level. That had a... Extra time reaches half-time. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. And so, the last chance to find a winner. They have played themselves to a near standstill. What is left in the tank now? Forward it goes. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. Oh, decisive action by the goalkeeper. He knew he had to get that done. It was a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Fires from distance. He'll hit it. No, he's missed it. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. He's away! Goes for goal! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Desperate defending required here. to meet it you can get that clear and the shot and that is the end of it they hung on right till the finish uh, whatever the shortcomings on either side it was a great game to watch just one between them so Jim how do you reflect on what we've seen Norway really approached this game with clear intent Peter and a, a training ground plot was turned into a very good success so just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.